Do I owe you now, Fitz? Do I get to show how worthy I am of your sacrifices now, Fitz? Do I get to talk to wives at cocktail parties for you, trade recipes for you, plan dinners for you, live in this cage for you, and not breathe for you? Tell me, what must I do to prove I am forever indebted to you for saving my father's life? Olivia. Be your housewife, your girlfriend, your property. Man, I She's love so that good. show. It was so good. She's best known for her Emmy-nominated performance in the hit series Scandal, of course. And now actress Kerry Washington is opening up in a new memoir, Hitting Shelves Today. And Jake had the chance to chat with her all about it. Interesting, too, because she's fairly private. Yeah, for the most but part. Uh, not anymore. Right. She's opening mm -hmm. up a lot. So Carrie Washington really opens up, reveals herself in a new personal memoir. It's called Thicker Than Water, hits books, uh, store shelves today. She discusses uh, many things, including the fact that her dad is not her biological birth father. Uh, she was once recognized while having an abortion. She suffers from an eating disorder, suffered from an eating disorder. Uh, she really holds nothing back in this book. It's the kind of book that shows really how much she's changed and grown and evolved over the years. So when we sat down to discuss Thicker Than Water, we started out talking about that growth and the difference between the woman she's writing about and the woman she is today. There are also a lot of moments in this book that really, I think, exemplify how far you've come as a person in every form and fashion, personally and professionally. What is the difference between the woman who you're writing about and the woman who wrote the book? Oh, wow, what a great question. I mean, I think in the book, I'm writing about so many different women in a way, right? Because we all evolve so much throughout our lives. And I think at different points in my life, I've been so many different people, especially when I think about all the different characters I've played and how they've impacted my life, which again, is something that I write a lot about. So I don't know. I mean, I think the person that I am today is maybe somebody who has integrated more of those various personalities and experiences and traumas and adventures and sort of coalesce them into one person. That's what I'm trying to do. I think I'm trying to be more integrated and authentic and honest as myself. You have so much more of your life and your career to come, which hopefully maybe decades from now might mean another book. If you could have your next memoir in your hands right now and get to read one chapter, what is the part of your your future, the chapter that you would most love to read if you could crack it open at this moment? Oh my God, my heart just started beating so fast. Um, I would want to read the chapter about how happy and fulfilled my children are. Yeah. Damn it. I I know. It wasn't, it, wasn't, it wasn't supposed to end this way. <laughs> oh, We're going to have more great. from Carrie Washington coming up in the next hour of Good Day Chicago. Carrie will be in Chicago on Thursday when her book tour comes through town. Tickets are available, including the chance to meet her and get a picture with her. Just visit AtheneumCenter.org for more information. Her book, Thicker Than Water, is on store shelves now. Loved her in Scandals. Such She's a great so actress. So good. So, so good. good. That's something they could reboot, right? That's Scandal? a good yeah, reboot. Yeah, they could do Scandal. Yeah. 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 I'd watch That's it. one of the few shows that, yeah. Okay.